Planet Imagination. I went into the hospital. I remember when I was younger, I was in a room with another sickle cell patient that I actually knew. And she was like crying in the excruciating pain. But at this point, I, um, one of my state, I had already, my, my pain had already gone. And the nurse walked in and she was like, you really should um, act like she is. You know what I mean? She'd be quiet like she is. Heartbeats and sickle cell. Heartbeats and sickle cell. Yeah. <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. All right, well, greetings. I am Lady Wu. You're a local Lady Wu from Birmingham, Alabama. The Sickle Cell Walk is one of the biggest fundraisers that I know of as far as any Sickle Cell Foundation nationally. Sit on the bed for the first time and the person cries because they say when I sit on the bed that they are in pain and, and that hurts. That's something you have to see. That's something that if I tell you that, you may not understand it. If you haven't confessed Jesus as your Lord and Savior, I want you to do that. I just want you to, I just want you to stop and meditate on your life in the goodness of Jesus. I just want you to do that and nothing else. If you can't confess them right now, if you're suffering from a disease, a mental disease, more more, more specifically, because it's harder to get over something mentally and it is physically. It's sick of cell. It's got to be the pressure for the body because you can't see it, you can't explain it. Therefore, it should not be the mental. Everybody's been, I've died took antidepressants before. Everybody has been mentally diseased. I buy the spirit of suicides. You can you, there's no such thing as a pain worth killing yourself for. That has never been and it would never be again. Planet Imagination.